Hello my friends, Takuya here, and welcome back to Shogun 2 Total War. Yes, I know it has been a while, but my friends, we are switching things up in the games that we're going to be playing, and today I want to show you something extra special. Easily, what I saw from the comments when I put out that poll that was asking for suggestions of what games and what challenges to play, you all actually presented me with one of my favorite things that I love to do, that is so completely and utterly broken, and is just so ahistorical and dumb and I love it. The last time we did anything here, we did a challenge where we did the Fall of the Samurai using only traditional units. But what if we did something that was a little bit of the reverse? Not Fall of the Samurai, not even Rise of the Samurai, but the base Shogun 2 game, the original campaign that came out in like, what was that, 2011? God, I love this game. You have no idea how many times I played this campaign over and over and over again. It is so much incredible fun. For those of you who are unfamiliar with the Total War series, the way that these games work is that you take control of a country, of a clan, of something in history that typically starts out smaller in a period that can lead to wide-scale war with the world around you, and you build that clan or family or whatever from the ground up and conquer everything in total war. And the base Shogun 2 campaign takes place during the Sengoku Jidai, the period of war in Japan in which it was literally called the Age of War, the Sengoku Jidai. But among all the clans that you can see listed here, there was a challenge that I saw listed in the poll that my friends I absolutely love. Playing as the Otomo and convert Japan to Christianity. Every single clan that you can see listed in here has a specific kind of bonus that is particular to them. The bonus of the Otomo is that they are the only clan in the entire game here in the beginning that starts out as Christian. They were the first to make contact with the Portuguese, establishing trade links in return for advanced European guns and other goods, and since their arrival, Otomo Soren had showed tolerance towards the Jesuit conversion of his subjects and may even convert himself one day. Now, overall, from what they were showing in here, they didn't actually fully convert to Christianity, like the Daimyo didn't, but this is a very interesting a historical thing of like, well, what if the clan just was overall Christian and it just started out as that? The only one from the beginning of the game, though other clans are able to convert. My friends, Christianity is completely and utterly broken in this game, and I'm going to show you why. But without further ado, I talk too much, so you know what? Let's go ahead and begin. Just check out this intro here in the first place. I, I, like, I swear, it's, it's so cool. Strangers have come to our shores. They bring weapons of smoke and fire. Weapons that kill without honor, without skill. The freaking Portuguese man! I love I love how they're I love how they're displayed in here. It's just it's beautiful. These foreigners and their guns could give a man power and victory. And victory wipes away dishonor. Truth has come with the foreigners, and souls can be saved by following the church's teachings. Heathens who cling to the old ways will be compelled by the power of Christ to kneel before God. I swear, something about a Japanese voice saying heathens will be forced to, like, to the knee, like they will be compelled by the power of Christ. It just sounds hilarious to me. Here we are from the beginning of the game, which brings us our first mission, In Good Faith. The thing that we have to do is construct a chapel because we have welcomed the Nanban, their religion and their knowledge, and profited as a result. We must honor our agreements with them whilst taking care not to offend our subjects and their beliefs. Except, in this case, we actually start out, our total clan is actually Christian from the very beginning. And because we are Christian, our daimyo actually starts with minus one honor. Honor is a system in this game that what that enables you to do is uh, have better relations with powers around you, and people are more likely to adhere to your diplomatic uh, overtures. So we actually start the game with two provinces overall, which is significantly more powerful than a lot of the states around us. What we're going to go ahead and do in both Bungo and also in Buzen is immediately build chapels right off the bat. And the reason that we're going to spend this instead of getting economic or military buildings is because check this out. Unlike what ends up happening with the lower power threshold of Shinto buildings. Every single chapel that you build increases the rate at which chi arts are mastered by 5%. Plus one happiness for the Christian population, plus 2% to town growth from all buildings, which is awesome. And that has a high rate of conversion of 1.5 instead of the base 1, and simultaneously from the very beginning of the game, spreads zeal to neighboring provinces. That's right, baby. We're converting people through the power of Christ, and we can't be stopped. You will see this as time goes on, but what is so incredibly broken about Christianity is that as you convert, not only can you research things faster because of better access to outside technology, but simultaneously in converting the lands around us to Christianity, this means that those states cannot have their armies leave their fortresses, or else because they will be at 100% Christianity, the people will almost instantly revolt. 
because no one wants to be ruled by a bunch of Buddhist samurai when they're all Christian. So first things first, we're going to go ahead and put our missionary over here in the settlement of Bungo so we can start converting. And we're actually going to take our daimyo as well as all of our men from this, and we're going to move them over to Buzen. We are currently at war with both the Shoni as well as the Oichi, which is a little bit of a difficult thing to be at war on two different fronts from the very beginning. But don't worry, we'll be fine. Instead of upgrading any of our buildings because we are at war with multiple powers, we're gonna go ahead and get a trade ship so that we can get some money going. And simultaneously, I'm going to recruit two units of Yariashigaru from this site so that I can consolidate and make a bigger army. One of the other great bonuses is that because we have access to Nanban train, this means that from the very beginning of the game, we can actually recruit gun units. Go ahead and get some Bo Ashigaru starting to recruit over here in Buzen, and we are going to consolidate and make a decent force. Simultaneously, Master of the Arts, we are going to want an economy as soon as possible because the further that we can develop things over here on our cheese side, that means a hospital, but also, where is it? Jesuit Seminary. If we can upgrade our buildings over on this side, down the Christian side, we're only going to increase the bonuses that we're going to get and spread Christianity further, which in turn is going to destabilize everything around us. So we are going to hard press into Chi. Trade-wise, can I trade with anything? The Sagata? Trade? No, nope, you're not going to trade. An unexpected meeting may with Heinz turn out to be well. Let us see what happens. Yeah, you refuse to trade. Don't give me that crap, you little shit. Yes, Chapel built the word of God. That's going to start conversion here in our populace, which is going to be great. The more that we have of that, the better. And simultaneously with the way of Chi, that means we're going to start increasing stuff for taxes. That means rice exchange is what we're going to be wanting next for less upkeep on our units and also more money. Catholicism and cash, you know, it just goes hand in hand, baby. Mission issued, might and money. The chapel has been completed. We should now establish a non-bond quarter at our foreign trade port, opening the way for greater military and trade opportunities. We can have non-bond ships for both commerce and conquest armed with cannon to smash our enemies. So now it's asking us to construct the following building, a non-bond quarter, which is going to give us a unit of Portuguese tercos, which are extremely powerful. That is a very expensive building to build though. Uh, I can't quite do that yet. So we're gonna need to bide our time before we can actually do that. And in the meantime, since we got all these units up here, go ahead and take our daimyo, take some Ashigaru, maybe one of the gunmen, and let's move them over here and see if we can investigate. What do they even have over here? Nothing much. Okay, they're probably gonna move in some units to take that territory or defend it, but it should be fine. And now that we have chapels, that means recruiting missionaries. The more missionaries that you recruit, the more you convert. Missionaries are not only going to strengthen your own troops' morale if you put them in your army, but simultaneously they spread Christianity and destabilize everyone else. You know how missionaries typically function. Yeah, see, see, they moved all their troops in here. Uh -huh. That is not something I could probably take on with my current army, which is significantly weaker than I would want. Okay, all right, we're going to move them back, take the missionary, plant you in here to inspire the army to increase morale, which is going to be useful for us, and we are going to need to recruit some more men before we do anything. Now, as for the trade ships, I am moving the trade ships over here in order to take each and every single one of these little points. All of these that you can see here are outside trade routes, which if you can seize, is going to give you access to valuable goods that you need to research certain things and get certain buildings. Plus, they make you a decent amount of money, which is actually really good for us. And from here, there's really not much else we can do until the next turn when we start to attack Fukuoka. I think that's going to be the decisive moment. Until then, we just need to go down here and claim every single trade route that we possibly can and build up our supply. To that end, it is time to to siege out the enemy. And now let's see if the Shoni are brave enough to attack me. They might, they might be. We'll see what happens. Oh, yep, they're bringing in their forces. That is, oh, it's another unit of Yadi Samurai. Okay, that's, that could be dangerous. Okay, well, my friends, no time like the present. Let's do it. I also, I love the speeches at the beginning of this game. The fact that Total War got rid of speeches is such a massive shame. It makes no sense because this was beautiful. That's right, that's right. Duty, duty and honor. Duty for the boot. Wait, no, that sounds different. Don't cheer for that. Let's see where they appear in the first place. Are they up on the mountain? I think they are. Yeah, they, they are further back here and they're gonna be slowly moving in here towards me. We move our bowmen to the front to absorb the initial shock, and our matchlocks, we're actually going to stick them further higher up here on the hill. The reason being is that as melee engages, we're actually going to be able to fire over our men into the enemy ranks. At least, that's the hope. I'm hoping that I'll be able to do that. Oof. Okay, hold up. They are, they are spreading the... Are they sending them out there for a flank? They are. You little, you little shits. Shit, form a spear wall. Retreat. Hi 
Forbidden units have been discovered, my lord. Oh, no. There goes their general. Ah, they're... Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Our they tried to flank me. Is in grave danger, my lord. Surround them. Surround them. Oh, we have massacred at least one general over on this side. My lord, their general has fallen. A cutting blow. Oh, it is becoming a wild and desperate melee. Hold up. Here come the samurai retainers. Brace for impact. Quick, 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 quick. We're going to take some serious damage here. Fire! We drove them off. Yes! Men are running from the battlefield. Shameful display. Our men are running from the battlefield. Shameful display. Okay, okay, okay. We are losing in some spots, but we have taken it in others. Wait, did we win? Did they run away? I think we did it. We did it. Oh my god, that was close. <laughs> oh. Decisive victory. Only 80% of our army lost. Ah, okay. Uh, wow. Yeah, yeah. I lost over half my army. I mean, I killed almost all of theirs, yes. And my troops gained some extremely valuable experience, but I did lose one division. You know what? That's fine. That is still a beautiful, beautiful victory. And now that I'm going to attack this settlement, I actually realize that what I'm going to have to do is I will have to actually assault it because if I do auto-resolve, I'm pretty sure that half of these divisions are just going to die. Like, these, they'll just auto-delete themselves. So I'm feeling like a little bit of revenge then. And yoink. Oh my God. Look at all those arrows. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> oh no. Sir, please don't abandon me. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> yeah, goodbye. Decisive victory. All right, with that, the settlement is taken. Our general is going to level up and we will peacefully occupy it. That means that this territory here in the north actually has very fertile soil. So this is going to become the primary economic center of our new empire that we're going to be building for the sake of God. Which, speaking of God, that means the first thing that we're going to actually do on here is build a chapel. And then after that, we will actually go and upgrade the rice fields. Even though this will make us a lot of money, religion matters more, my friends. Then with our general leveling up, a mage... Ooh, ooh, plus one to the daimyo's honor and plus one command to attacking. Yes, I will take that and increase my honor from the little bit that it is. In the meantime, I'm going to have to pretty much sit here for a couple turns and I'm going to have to replenish all of my men because I'm I'm not doing so hot. <laughs> yeah, uh, re remember what I said about n n not not doing so hot? That's uh that's that's not good. Okay, go ahead and redeploy all these troops over to the side and yes, you're going to need to protect Buzin with your very lives. With your lives, good sir. Great clan destroyed. What clan died? The Hatori. Oh, the ninjas died. If you all want to see a future ninja playthrough where we actually play as the Hatori and do a ninja only challenge, then by all means, go ahead and like this video right now. If this video gets 5,000 likes, I will do a ninja only challenge as the Hatori clan. But okay, let's, uh, let's see what happens then. The Sagara? Oh, oh, you bastards. They're going to move an army in to attack me now, aren't they? Hey, boy. Yeah, no, I can't fight that. Retreat. Really? 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 You're raided. You bastard. I can't even go and attack you right now. All I, I, I have to focus on the defense of my castle back here because the Sagata just went and declared war on me. So now I gotta wait like one more turn here before I could potentially do the more. You bastards! Why does everyone hate the Christians? I'm trying to bring peace and prosperity to all of you through the power of crusades and God. The threat of attack the Ito. Are you freaking serious? Even though I really want to focus on Chi right now, the unfortunate reality is we're going to have to focus on martial wisdom because the Ito are now also threatening to attack me, which is lovely. I, I, I love that that is the case. So now, Oichi, you have a choice. Convert or die. You chose to die. My friends, in open plains, this field is going to soak with your blood. All right, lads, it's time to start moving up. They're going to move their archers here to the front in order to be able to try and draw me in. And the thing is, that's that's going to work because that's precisely what it is that I'm going to try to do to them. Draw them in, they're stopping, and archers fire! My men are slightly more experienced. We have slightly more arrows firing in their direction too, which means that we should be able to whittle them down fairly quickly. Yep, this is a decent amount of damage that we are doing. They are desperately trying to fire back, but it's not going to work. Slaughter! You know, it's funny. From this angle, it actually looks like their spearmen behind them are actually bracing their spears to stop their archers from retreating. 
shooting. And that's why even though they've lost like 80% of their number, they still haven't run away. Ah, never mind. Now they run away, which means... The archers up here are getting ready to move, and we can start laying down some fire on them. It looks like their gunmen are moving in here as well. Yup, that is a general. Okay, okay, move forward. Oh, she got her to the front. And brace. Okay, they retreated. They retreated. They, we called their bluff. We called their bluff. All right, now they're just going to move forward, try and send their archers forward, and it's not going to work on this side. Oh, the gunmen. The gunmen, are you ready? Are you ready? Fire! <laughs> Oh my god, fire by rank. Oh, now Neil. Now Neil. Get ready. Oh, absolute slaughter. <laughs> oh, Neil down again. Get ready for it. No, that's all they went for. Okay, they retreated. Oh shoot, here comes their general. George! Kill their general! Go! Stab the horses! Kill their archers! Kill the general! Charge, Spearman! Go! Oh, beautiful. A beautiful route. Yes, victory! Continue the battle, though. We want to slaughter as many of them as possible. I know that Christ teaches forgiveness, but honestly, do you think that he could forgive me for slaughtering all these men before they could convert? I guess as that famous quote goes, kill them all, let God sort them out. Whew, only 500 men lost, and yet we slaughtered their entire army. Beautiful. Let's go ahead and go over here and finish them off, and bam. General, dead, everyone, gone. Now what I should probably do is take some of these units and still deposit them back on the front line. Just something over here that will at least be able to preserve this fort. The rest of these troops will have to make their way over here to Tsukushi because we're going to need to consolidate everything on this side. We are currently at war with quite literally everyone around us. Oh, you prick. You prick, Mori. And there go the Ito. Yep, yep, figured. Figured that that was going to happen. Ha ha ha. Ah, great. Great. I love it. I love it. Thank you, Sagara, for sending such a such a fun force over here to attack me. Have you been introduced to guns yet? All right, quick move all forces over. They're going to be trying to race in here as rapidly as possible. Uh, as for these troops, maybe we're going to move them outside here. They're going to try to rush forward as soon as possible, but I'm going to do an immense amount of damage to them with my guns. Tally ho, lads. Fire! <laughs> oh my god! Just like the same guy getting shot 20 times. <laughs> All right, here they are. They're rushing the walls. All right, Ashigaru, rush outside. Rush outside. They're going to be storming things here soon. We got to be able to hold. Yes, but they're shattering. They're running. Go. Charge them. Yes. Yes, we drove them off the walls. We attacked from the rear. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. All right, there's their last unit. Get ready. Get ready, men. Lower your spears and charge. Ah, go! <laughs> oh my god! Oh, just tearing into them. Beautiful. My lord, a glorious victory will soon. Glorious victory, yes! <laughs> Uh, like, I knew that we were going to win based off the numbers. The fact that it was an equal amount. If they had even one more unit, one more, I would have lost the castle. I would have. I would have. <laughs> but instead, we absolutely slaughtered them. Our troops gained some very valuable experience, which is going to be useful for defending things here in the future. And I'm going to... Great, great. Thank you. I love it. God, I can't even replenish any of this. No, you know, hold on. We're going to cancel the repair. We're going to cancel the repair because I'm going to need to recruit at least one more division over here to be able to defend because the Ito are coming at me with an army and I'm not, I'm not going to be able to defend with just what it is that I have here. In fact, I may want to even consider sending down my general. Yep. There they are moving into my territory in winter. Definitely not the smartest thing for them though. Are you serious? You managed to get an army here of what looks like a bunch of Yachty samurai. Really? Well, come here, you little bastard. Yeah, it is literally composed of entirely Yachty Samurai. Oh, okay. Well, this should be fun. You may have Samurai, but I got a gun. Fire! Kill the Samurai! No, oh, here they go. Okay, okay. Move on back. Move on back. Let them charge into me. Let them charge into me. Come here, horsies. Gunman, you also withdraw. It looks like they're going after you. Okay, lines are going to break apart. Slow motion. Let them charge. Let them hit. Our general is in grave danger, my lord. Quick, kill their general. Kill as many of them as possible. Fire in, fire in, fire in. Come on, gunman, reload faster. Yes, victory. Charge! Finish them off! The bowmen are the last one that remain. 
Oh no. Oh no. You samurai are not doing this right now. My lord. Yes. <laughs> they tried to go in for a final charge and now they're just getting shot in the back. Perfect. Battle over. Close victory. Yeah. Yeah. I know it was a close victory. All right. They had a whole bunch of samurai and we still won, but a victory is a victory. And that means the settlement is now mine. You think if a Christian daimyo focuses on poetry that eventually he'll write death poetry that is literally just the crucifixion. These are the questions that keep us up at night. But with he's in down, that is another territory with very fertile soil, which is awesome for me so I can get more stuff, but we're gonna have to destroy that. Yari's bill. We don't need tools of war. We just need the power of Christ. Come on. More churches. Oh, ho, 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 ho. That is not what I wanted. Um, shit. Well, lads, here we go then. I might actually lose my capital here. All right, lads, officially this one is gonna suck. Let's see what happens. Let's see, we got a commander on this side with two units of Yari Ashigaru. We got Yari Ashigaru over here with a, no, that's pure Yari. Wait, what is on this side? Is this just Bowman? Bo Ashigaru, Bo Ashigaru, Bo, oh, over here it's almost all Bo Ashigaru. I got a sneaky plan. Is it worth the risk? Maybe, maybe, we will see what we do. Go lads, quick, before they have opportunity. Oh, general is in grave danger, my lord. Yes, <laughs> they're wavering. We're knocking out one of their units, perfect. Yes, that drove one of them completely away. Beautiful. All right, now what we're going to simply do is bait them. And attack from the other side, quick. They may be sending the troops up the wall, but I am attacking from the rear again. <laughs> oh, completely devastating. Completely devastating. They have no idea what just hit. Run, 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 quick. Quick, you may be tired, but they are very tired. If we can just move around them lads, we will break free. Quick, they can't even read us. Run, run horsies. <laughs> oh my God, another hit. How many is that dead on this side? Oh, my general has killed almost 300 troops. Beautiful. All right, samurai retainers, come on. Go lads, kill the general. My lord, their general has fallen, cutting blow. Oh my god, we did it. <laughs> oh my lord. Close victory. No, 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 no. That wasn't a close victory. No, 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 no. I moved in there and my general managed to take out four full battalions of their forces. That was like the most ballsy shit I've ever done in this game. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, are you serious? We just managed to hold. Are you freaking serious? Oh no, oh no, no, no. <laughs> Why does everyone hate the Christians? Ito, would you make peace with me? We I have better sense <laughs> no one wants to make peace with me. Oh. You know what, lads? It's not worth it. It's not worth it. We aren't going to be able to hold. I can always retake the settlement later. So in fact, what I'm going to do is I'm going to withdraw all of my troops, abandon the settlement, And I'm withdrawing all troops back to Busan. I don't want to, but I have to. Okay, we're, we're abandoning everything. Yeah, because the Ito are about to take this and there's not really anything that I can do about it. Oh, oh, that hurts. That hurts. Oh no. Did the Sakura move all the way back? When did you move all of your troops? Oh no, 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 no. Shoot. Okay, okay. They have way more forces over here than I thought they did. Okay, number wise, we're going to need to consolidate things over here for a while. I'm doing okay on taxes. I don't want to have to raise to recruit because my people are already not necessarily very happy with me. We're going to wait for a little bit before we do any of that, and then we're going to try and consolidate and move on in. Wait, clan adopts- Who adopted Chris? The Ito! God wills it! <laughs> we managed to make them adopt Christian. <laughs> See, with the chapel built in Heezen, that means it's going to start growing over here for our support. And then, honestly, I can't I can't really do much over on the side. We're going to need to consolidate things here in the north, and then we're going to have to move down and attack Ito again. And I'm getting sieged. Again. Great. No. No. <sighs> Losing access to all trade. Well, there goes my navy. Great. Ironically enough, because I couldn't trade by losing my navy, I actually gained back money. Mori, 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 you are not. 
Mm, I can't lose my entire Navy. I got to retreat back. All right, lads, tally ho. We take back Ito. Home province recaptured. Beautiful. The more. Whoa, wait a minute. When were the Mori destroyed? Did that mean that their, na their navy is gone? Their navy is gone. I'm safe. I'm safe. Oh my God. Thank God. Praise Jesus. I can get access to some trade again. Oh, thank God. And they, oh my God, they destroyed. You destroyed my church. Ito, I do not care that you converted to Christianity. I will murder you. You destroyed a house of God. Great. Great. Thanks. I, I literally just sent that over. I appreciate it. Thank you, Sagara. I appreciate you. Is that another great? Now the Ikoiki have been destroyed. Oh my God, all the great clans are falling. All right, Ito, time to die. Let's go. In the name of God. In the name of God. In the name of God, we go to heaven. Yes, kill off their archers. Leave none standing. Oh boy, here they come. Let's go, lads. Yes! Yes! In the name of God! <laughs> Let them run! A decisive victory! Jesus Christ compels you! Beautiful. Wipe them out. And that means next turn we should be able to take Huga, and then from there move on and take out even more forces. Oh, really? 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 Are you genuinely really going to do me dirty like that? Okay, well, time to send over some forces as reinforcements. And hopefully that will draw... Oh, oh my God. Katana Samurai. Okay. I see how it is. Really? Among all things... No. No. You prick. You prick. No. Why is everyone burning all of my stuff to the ground? A worthy bride, 10%. Oh, upkeep cost of all units of this man's command. Minus one morale for all units under this man's command. You know what? I'll, I'll take I'll take the money. I'll take the money. I need... <laughs> everyone is burning my shit to the ground. It's so expensive to repair, too. Oh, that sucks. Screw you. All of you are dying. I don't even care. Well, shit, they're going for Tsukushi. I don't think that I can actually do anything on the side. Can I? Uh, I can send some forces over to defend. Maybe. Yeah, we're going to have to do that. We're going to have to send some forces over here. Maybe defend this spot. I don't know if it'll actually work. I can't get anything around this way. They're just going to... Oh. Ito, will you make peace? Speak Wait, you will. Then I will reply. Trade agreement? You will become trade partners with me. Wait a minute. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Before I do any of this, uh, maybe Oichi, will you take peace? Speak no, you will not. Okay. Speak. The saga? No, no. But speak no, the saga will not accept peace. Okay, wait a minute. But I could accept peace with Ito. Look, sometimes we have to compromise for Christ. I do not wish to listen to you. Will you, will you give me payments? Strange and sometimes unwelcome encounters. You'll give me a thousand gold to fuck off? Okay, you know what? Sure. I'll accept that because I got bigger fish to fry over here. No, 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 no. That's not gonna... Well, there they go. I love this. Come on in, you fucks. All right, we got Katana Samurai, Katana Samurai, Katana Samurai. Okay, we got three units of Katana Samurai outside here. Uh, everyone else, literally every single other entity is concentrated over on this side. Fantastic. Okay. You know what, we're gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna send my general out here. He's gonna serve as bait. I want them to charge at me. I want them to. I'm gonna try and I'm gonna try and stake my archers around them as much as I possibly can. All right, here they come. They're just slowly, there they are slowly crawling their way up here. They don't even care. They don't even care. Well, the power of Christ compels you, motherfuckers. Come on, come on, come at me, come at me. I'm leading you away. I'm leading away, you fuckers. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Oh my god, my mouse literally died as I was doing this. That was dangerous. There we go. There we go. Bait him away from the walls. Bait him away. Come on, General. Do your damn job. There we go. The samurai are taking some big hits. They're taking some big hits. We're leading them away. Beautiful. <laughs> they completely abandoned the side. Yes. Oh, but they are at the walls over here. Brace for impact, lads. Our general is in grave danger, my lord. Come on. Come on. Yes. Bait them in. The more tired they get, the worse that they are. If they try to climb the walls as they are now, they'll start dropping like flies. Yes. The samurai are breaking. We're breaking them. 
<laughs> yeah, I can't even react. If I had light cavalry, this would be even better. But because it's my general, they are actually targeting him. And here comes the general. Oh, wait, no. Here actually comes the general. He's after me. Oh, no. They're chasing me. It's a literal race against time here. One of our units has all its ammunition. My it's a trap. A Christian trap. Go, my brothers. Kill their general. My lord, glorious victory will soon be. We old. did it. <laughs> Wait, they shattered. They shattered. Kill. Kill the samurai. A decisive victory! Oh my god! That is that has gotta be one of the greatest things I think I've ever done here. Beautiful! Cut down! Are you <laughs> listen? You can't I can't do it anymore. I can't I'm tired of running around with this navy. It's not gonna get away this time. It's not gonna get away. I can't <laughs> ah! But with the Oichi army destroyed and the Ito now at peace, that means that we can finally focus on the Sagara. Because if we can finish them off, at least we'll be able to secure Kyushu. To that end, while their army is distracted up here, time to send us over to this side. Because the thing is, they will have to attack me here. If they don't attack me here, they have to retreat. And if they don't retreat, then I'm going to take Hegel. So what's going to happen, Sagara? It's your call. Oh, they are going for it. Ho, 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 ho. Oh, this is, um, this is going to be a big one. And I actually, I can't bait them like I did before. Okay, that's going to be a little bit of an issue. Well, all right, lads. Into the breach. Here they come, lads. To arms for Christ. Christ compels you. No, there's the reinforcements heading in here from the south. Okay, that's perfectly fine. We are taking them over here. It is only Yari Ashigaru, and they appear to be dying in droves. Our general is in grave danger, my lord. Here they go. They are sending forces up. We are steadily fighting them away. Oh, my lord. They are pouring in. No, my matchlock brothers. Don't get off the walls. Don't get off the walls. Katana samurai. More katana samurai. I do not want them anywhere near me. Yep, here comes their general. They're sending in the additional forces. Oh, lad, there are a lot of them. Okay. What the hell? Why did my bow Ashiaru leave? No. No, 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 no. I did not tell you to leave. Oh, okay. Okay, that's a lot of dead. I have lost a ton of men here. My bowmen are dead. Everyone is dead. Charge! My lord, a glorious victory will soon be yours. Yes! Yes! Ride them down! Ha 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 ha! Leave none alive! Let God sort them out! I have a feeling this game is bringing out the absolute worst of me, but uh, to be fair, considering everything that they have been doing to me, they deserve it. Oh, okay. That actually was a close victory. Ah, uh, ha! Uh, unfortunately for me, I did end up losing one of my matchlock units, which is which sucks. It sucks, but at least some of the others are gaining some experience, and we are getting some actually pretty strong units from all this. To be honest, at this point, I'm probably a little bit more sad about the guns than anything else. Because with those forces completely destroyed, that means now I can move in and take Hegel. With the fall of Higo, I now gain Imperial Recognition. The more recognition that we get, the more status we have. The problem with more status is it means that other powers are going to start to think of us more of a threat, as though they didn't think that we were already. And with Higo, we have even more very fertile soil. Excellent. Now, this one also has horse breeders, which is going to be great for recruiting some cavalry. So I actually will keep the war horse stables and everything else here. But I do want to upgrade this place to be able to get a church because Christ compels you. Now you offer me peace. Now you do. Really? Really? You're already at war with everyone else. Fuck you. Fuck no. Really? 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 Fun.
Conflict of beliefs. A man has been found openly speaking of his Buddhist beliefs among the good Christian people of this province. No, 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 cannot do, cannot do. Religious zeal, execute him, execute him. And here it is, Sagara, your final settlement. You just really ought not to have done what you did, buddy. You really shouldn't have done that. <laughs> oh my god, this is such a... Uh, yeah, yeah, going up against a, a force of samurai inside of a fort is definitely a very painful experience. I, I, I will say that. My lord, their general has fallen. A cat hit blow. Oh, oh. Uh, yeah, okay. Sacrifice. Sacrifice. It's just, just, you know, just all in the name of Christ, my friends. No problem. But with that, my friends, we have captured Satsuma, and from that, everything except for Ito here on Kyushu is now controlled by me. And this gives us access to the blacksmith, so we can start making even more powerful units. Um, are you serious? Are you freaking serious? Of all times, now you choose to come and attack me. You're not welcome on my island, good sir. Here they come, lads. Get ready. All right, they've reached the walls. They're coming up. Are they going to come up on any of these sides? It does not appear to be. They seem to be more so trying to consolidate all their forces, which I applaud them for. That's actually the right move of what they should be trying to do. Whew, of course, they have so many archers over here that I'm going to be taking some serious damage while trying to defend my walls. Oh, my archers are getting eviscerated over here. Shoot, how many of the... They have so many archers. Okay, all right. That could be a little bit of a problem. Commander, darling. Let's go, lads. Charge! Our general is in grave danger, my lord. Damn, because these Ashigaru are so experienced, they're actually doing some damage to my general, and they're managing to hold. All right, quick, my general is taking some serious damage. We need to withdraw him. Our men are running on the battlefield. Shame for this play. Charge! Our entire unit has perished. Oh my god, I am losing so many men. <laughs> We did it! Oh my god! What do you mean that they're running from the battlefield? We're just merely running in the opposite direction of the enemy. That's all. It doesn't. It, that's not running away. A costly victory. <laughs> uh, hey, listen. It's all right. Don't worry. We're only gonna meet up in heaven anyway. Just like it doesn't matter, guys. Guys, guys. It, it doesn't matter. It's fine. Whew, that is um. Though though those are some losses then. Damn. And I also couldn't kill their general. Are you kidding me? Oh no. Are you serious? You're doing it again. Why? Our general is in grave danger, my lord. My lord, their general has fallen. A cat in blue. My lord, a glorious victory will soon be yours. This was so dumb. I don't know why you did that. I don't know why you did that. Which I still didn't manage to kill the good general. Ah. Well, at least I'm grinding for experience here, I guess. Really? Really, Ito? I totally wasn't going to be betraying you anytime soon anyway. I mean, to 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 totally, to totally not. But that doesn't seem very Christian-like now, does it? But you're still a dick. And now you have to go and attack a settlement. Really? How rude. I got bow samurai, bitch. You ain't moving. Our general is in grave danger, my lord. My lord, a glorious... 
this fix tree will soon be you. Yeah, yeah. See, that's what I thought. My lord. <laughs> oh, oh, general attacks my army. Gets shot in the back by arrows trying to run away. Beautiful. Fit command. You know what? Sure. I will take a general. I'm going to need plenty of them with the fights that we're going to have here soon. And that is one down and Osumi. Or should I say Oyasumi? Which no, 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 no one probably knows what I, I that's good night in Japanese. It's it's a really bad pun. But that's that province captured. Wonderful. Oh, really? Really, Amako? Again? Well, either way, I guess it doesn't matter because you know what? That is the last settlement of Kyushu captured. Hyuga has fallen, and with it. The Christianization of Shikoku is complete. Now, here's the thing. Every single one of these provinces, with the exception currently of Satsuma, has a church in it right now. And this is what I've been talking about from the very beginning for how powerful Christianity is. Obviously, this playthrough has been significantly harder since I've been playing it on a harder difficulty and simultaneously have gotten bad luck with every single person declaring war on me, which is something that can happen. But we are rapidly progressing down our economics tree to becoming an economic powerhouse. And the only reason that we're able to research things this fast is because we currently have a 40% bonus to Chi research. Something that is only going to get more powerful with time as our different characters upgrade and simultaneously as we build more churches. Every church we build gives a 5% bonus. A 40% bonus is pretty much what you get as a result of some really good events. And so as time goes on, we're only going to become more powerful. Wait a minute, what the hell? Matsu Wait a minute. Uh, Matsuda? Matsuda? Hold up. Hold the damn phone. I see you. I see you bringing an army over here. And so you wait a minute. You wait a damn minute. Really? You know what, lads? You could not live with your failure. And so where has that brought you? Back to me. My friends, I think this is going to be the last battle of this episode. God wills it. We bring the heathen to justice. The awesome thing is, since this castle is being attacked so many times, I upgraded it from a stronghold to a fortress, which adds a second level of defense to it. As for whether or not that really matters for us, uh, who can say? We gotta get our troops organized here fast. All right. Archers, all archers. You know what? We're just gonna go ahead and set you up here. Gunmen, let's see. We got seven units of this that is ranged. No, actually another one because we have a bow garrison. Now, bow garrisons, among these other things, can effectively be used as sacrificial lambs, so we will have to see where it is that the enemy is going to be appearing even in the first place. That seems like a pretty decent setup. All right, my friends, it's time to begin. The plan is that as soon as they start to get close to the walls, we are going to withdraw from the outer layer of defenses and move our way inwards. In doing so, we are going to cause them to have to climb and to sacrifice as many of their people as reasonably possible. To that end, I'm actually going to withdraw these gunmen. I'm going to place them up top because that seems like a better idea to at least move some so I don't create a massive chokehold. Actually, no, I'm not covering all of my points over on this side. I can actually put some gunmen over here. Let's see where they move in troops. They're moving. They actually have them spread out all around, which means they're just going to be spreading out the damage that they're going to be receiving here. Let's see, where are they? And it looks like they're starting to climb the walls down here. Okay. Overall, it's just yada yashigaru, yada yashigaru. It's just yada yashigaru. Where are their samurai? Oh, both samurai are concentrated in the center. And here, here it is. This is where the big blow is coming from. Okay. So what I'm going to do is move some Ashigaru down to this side here, and then simultaneously we're going to need to move some Yari Ashigaru garrisons down here. We're going to need to do as much as we possibly can in order to defend ourselves from these Bo Ashigaru. And as these have made it to the front here, we're going to put you all gunmen up top. Mm, the Ashigaru are starting to take some damage. Okay, withdraw the archers, withdraw the archers, retreat back. Our men are running from the battlefield. Shameful display. All right, withdraw the archers. Go ahead and put these men over on the side. Where are these men fighting? They are fighting over here with more yada yada ashigaru. The garrison. Oh shoot! Those matchlock already got driven back. All right, withdraw. Withdraw to the inner defenses. There we go. In withdrawing back, they now have to send their cavalry to the front because the Yari got trapped. Since they got trapped here from this killing zone, that meant that our gunman is making short work of them. Ah, uh, but the majority of their army is dead. Now they can only send forward the archers as well as their general, who is... Your general is getting ready to climb my walls. What are you doing? You're just getting shot! Enemy have taken the tower!
There we go. Run over them. Trap them. Trap them. Trap them. Keep on moving in. Their archers are getting ready to flee. Their general is trapped up on the higher levels. That means he's only going to die. My lord, yes. Yes. Continue the fight. Here. Don't let them get drained out. We need to kill them. Is that is that their commander? I think that's their commander. <laughs> this is the commander. <laughs> Come on. Come on, buddies. Come on. Someone shoot him. Someone shoot him. Is this just a tower? <laughs> the tower just got him. Yoink. I may have lost half my men, but simultaneously, once again, I have slaughtered the majority of theirs. And that means the last thing that we're just going to do on here is that just, just a little bit of a cleanup job. Just a little bit of a cleanup. Beautiful. Beautiful. Buzen, once again, is safe. Jushu has been Christianized. And my friends, I think that it is time to end things here for today's episode. I have been playing this for the last, what, four and a half hours, five hours. This takes a long time to create. So if you'd like to see more, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I will continue with this video depending on how it is that performs, but really, honestly, who knows? And so with that little cleanup job, I think that we are going to end things here today. My friends, this is a great stopping point for us because again, as I said, we have Christianized all of Kyushu and we are starting to build our economic base to be able to launch our invasion into Japan. So if you would like to see the Otomo clan, Christianize and launch a glorious crusade to drive out the idolaters out of Japan, then by all means, go ahead and like this video right now. If you want to see us launch a crusade, you're going to need to let me know in the comment section below. But without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and let you go. I have been recording here for the last like five or six hours here at this point, and I'm, I'm tired. Goodbye, my friends. I will see you next time.